we've been on the road most of the day today. Tina and I um, are going down to Hopkinsville, Kentucky. And we've got a conference there this weekend that we are really excited. There's a group of ex-Mennonites that you guys will meet. They um, came out of, well, I'm gonna let them tell their own story. <laughs> yeah, it's a great story. Neat people. And we're on the interstate going zero miles an hour because something has happened up here. We've been here already for about five minutes and we're not moving at all. Look, there's green grass. <laughs> One of the special blessings about this visit is not just the ministry that we get to have amongst our friends in Hopkinsville, but we have not seen Simeon face to face for how long? Three months. Three months. Yeah, we miss him. Mommy knows. Mm -hmm. But uh, we're going to get to see Simeon because he's driving up from uh, the grandparents in Atlanta to come spend the weekend with us. Yay! Once we got past the accident, we eventually started rolling again. We were off to see our friends from Kentucky. It had been almost nine months since we had last seen our friends in Kentucky. So we're very much looking forward to being able to reconnect and see what God had done. But also very much looking forward to reuniting with our son, Simeon. Simeon has been staying with his grandparents in Georgia since returning from Africa. It has been nine months since we had our conference with our friends in Kentucky. They welcomed us with a good home-cooked supper and all their children. We were able to catch up, to share, to pray, and enjoy being together. Even though I was really excited for the conference, I really enjoy being able to sit and relax and to just have fellowship, to be able to pray, to be able to talk and discuss. And tonight was really rich with the presence of God. It was great to see how they had grown. The love and peace of Christ were so prevalent. Even new people were coming into their midst. It was obvious that God had continued to make changes in their life, and we were really looking forward to being here. But while some things change, there are some things that never change. I love my mom. If you're enjoying these full speed blogs, be sure to like, subscribe, and comment below. Thanks a lot. If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. If you're happy and you know it, then your life will surely show it. If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. If you're happy and you know it, stomp your feet. Yeah.